Hi, y'all. Truck driver Linda. Truck driver Paul is... Up front in my usual spot. <laughs> oh, look, the light. We have such good lighting today. We are... We delivered in um, San Francisco, and now we have some downtime. No, we're not in San Francisco. Unfortunately, there's very little parking there. We're about 65 miles east of San Francisco. We're in a little town called Ripon, California. So what is our video going to be about today? So when we did our truck tour, I my seasoning bag had been under there a little bit. So I thought today we could go over my seasonings a little bit. Um, let me see if I can get you guys where you can really see what it looks like in there. So that's my seasonings right there. <sighs> Pretty awesome, right? All right, so I know that I have an excessive amount. Other things, I use these very regularly. Um, so this, this right here, I don't know if anybody recognizes what it is. It's a tool bag, and we used our truck stop points and got it at the truck stop, so I didn't have to actually pay for it. The tool bag was Paul's idea. I had seasonings. Um, and they were just kind of scattered. I, I was having trouble keeping track of them. And they were just like everywhere. And Paul's like, well, you need like a tool bag for it. Ding dong. There it was. Um, so we saved up our truck stop points because they're like $25. Um, and got one. And it's just been so perfect ever since. And originally I thought, I, I've got the strap still on it. I thought I would hang it originally, but I don't. And then I also thought that I would use the pockets. It's got all these pockets for like utensils, but that didn't actually work out either. That's why the utensils are separate. They just, they kept falling out and it, it didn't work. It worked perfect just for the seasonings. So what I'm doing, the way I had done it before, I'm changing it. All right. So used to, here's one. I just had like the duct tape here and I would write right here what the seasoning was in big letters to make it easier kind of to see it. But I still had to, like, I would have to lift up all the time to read the seasonings down in the bag. So that wasn't working. So what I went to instead was labels on the top. That worked a lot better. Um, but I'm actually updating that as well. So I just, I got these labels, you know, in the office supply section at Walmart probably, and Sharpies. And now I have three colors of Sharpies. And I'm actually changing it. This one, um, this one will stay black. So, um, if it's an herb, then I'm using green. So it's going to be a way if I go in here and I'm like, I need oregano, then I'm going to look for the green labels. Otherwise, it, even with the labels on the top, it took me a little bit to find the season I need. Him. Just because there's, there's a, okay. I have an addiction to herbs and spices. Um, but I think anybody that cooks probably does. So, and then if it's a little spicy or has some heat to it, I'm using red. And um, then just like stuff like ground nutmeg, if it's a seasoning paprika, I'm going to leave it in black. So that is currently how I'm doing it. But what I will say is that the labels, they, they fall off sometimes. So I actually put the label on and then I use some scotch tape with it as well. So they're, they're sticky labels. What are these? It just has multi-use labels. Um, and they're sticky on the back. And I write on it and then I usually rip it in half because they're too long. So that's about a half of a label right there. And when I'm home, <laughs> I, these are my seasonings, whether I'm at home or on the truck. And it's beautiful because I can just pick this up and take it in the house. I think this works out very well oh, for you. I, oh, and then I've got these tins, I guess I should talk about. you got seasonings that I make myself. And these tins, we get hot tea in them. And they're great to recycle for homemade seasonings. It's really, I guess it's, I don't know. <laughs> it's a little heavy. <laughs> a two pounder? Yeah, more like a 20 pounder. Yeah, more like a 15. <laughs> you think 15? 15 to 20 pounds. Yeah, it, it's a little heavy. But I can admit that I have, we all have to have our addictions. And mine, 
is herbs and spices. So that's all we got for today. I guess we're going to go do some laundry and enjoy some of the really beautiful yes, weather. Because, oh my day gosh, out. outside today is just. Yes, it is. And after some of the cold, rainy weather we've been in, we're going to get out of the truck and yeah. take advantage of the good. We're not in an area to do anything. Unfortunately, we can't do like a travel video because of that. We're in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we are. There's nothing. There's a grocery store, though, and I think we might walk over there and get a few groceries. Yes. And other than that, we're just going to get out and walk. So. All right, y'all. That's all we got for today. Thanks for watching. Okay. Bye, y'all. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye, y'all.